The Sultan of Sakoto, Muhammadu Sa'ad Abu Bakr, says the propagation of Islam as a religion of peace and Islamic education a panacea for growth. He said this at the centenary lecture in honor of late Sheikh Adam al Luri in Lagos. Senate President Mukala Saraki and other Islamic scholars also stressed on the need to enhance educational standards and human resources for economic growth. Islamic education is conceptually construed by Imam Abu Anifa as a process of self-discipline which involves physical, mental, and spiritual training of man. And as another author said, is the balanced growth of the total personality of man through training of man's spirit, intellect, intellect, rational self, and bodily sciences. Islam has been painted in the religion of uh, violence. They will associate terrorism with us. Islam is a very peaceful religion. Mm. It is not all that people are saying they are. And I'm happy with what is happening now, with efforts. Like this, what my class is doing. And then in hopes of other ones, we are pushing the narrative out there to tell their own story. Sheikh Adam and the glory stood for unity, equity, and justice for all. May Allah continue to grant him our channel of the Amen. Distinguished guests, this important gathering therefore provides a good opportunity to call on Islamic leaders to espouse the lofty ideals of Islam, especially those promoting peaceful cohabitation, active citizenship, peace and equity, and of course, and justice. The most important thing is that uh, we must continue to strengthen our, our human resources. Um, People always say that um, our demographics, we have the population, but it must be population of people who are well educated, uh, well empowered. So the more an education is key. And I believe it's a good idea, but be be Maracas, be it any other uh, some institutions to all put all our efforts towards educating our people. And I think that is how we will strengthen our country, we empower people more we educated and be a greater country.